name is Matt, welcome back to the shop and today we're chucking that shit on the floor. Fucking rubbish. Today we are doing one of the last toolbox giveaway videos. One of the last. I don't know when the last one will be. It'll be before the draw, I hope. <laughs> so we've got some tools to add to the toolbox. Um, so number one is this 37 piece socket set, quarter inch drive, uh, backhoe, jobby. It's basically got some deep sockets, a little ratchet, an extension bar. I don't know if you can see that. That's what it's... Oh yeah, you can do a macro really well, can't you? I forgot about that. That's what it's got in it. So that's going in um, for the smaller sizes, for like 8mm, 6mm, 5mm, all that shit. The next thing we've got, because I couldn't find a, a brilliant brand... The CK stuff you can buy is okay, let me put it that way. So these are some wire strippers, some CK wire strippers, um, blah 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 blah, it tells you how to use them, all the rest of it. These are fucking awesome for a chink one go and it's just stripped your wires. So they're going in. Um, the next thing we've got is some uh, Vera, it's not Vera, <laughs> German, it's Vera and it, it's Knipex. But I'm going to say Nipex because the guys from um, Nipex UK say Nipex. So these are lovely box. Lovely box. Not that we care about the box. These are some long ass. Well, they're for picking your nose, really. Um, but there's two Phillips and one flathead. Um, what the fuck are these for? I'll tell you what these are for. These are for getting a carb uh, boots. For getting at the boots on your carbs and stuff and deep stuff inside engines. Um, not that deep, but if they are this long, then you know you've got everything fucking covered. Um, let me just slip the Johnny back on. Uh, yeah. So, that's that. There's more, there's more. But there's more! Um, so someone bought something off the eBay list. What's it say? This is from Corey Higginson. Hi Matt, sorry for the delay. My grandfather passed away last week and there was a bit going on. Sorry about that dude. Hope some young whippersnapper enjoys the toolkit you've put together. I know I would, regards Corey. So Corey went on the Amazon list that I've got that's in the description. And um, I will take this out of the fucking wrapper. Knife, good for cutting radiator holes. Serrated knife. Bread knives are even better. I've got a bread knife in the other work, um, other workshop, other fucking toolbox. That is actually in the other workshop. So that's why I said that. Um, God fucking hell. It's like Christmas, but not yet. Don't say Christmas fucking too early, Jesus Christ. So he got, and we had a bit of an argument about it, which is fair enough. We had a bit of an argument about hacksaws, so this is a uh, Eclipse, this is an Eclipse hacksaw and he was going on about, I think it was the back or one or something else. Um, these are the best, it's the blades but the actual handle, so you can get one that's all ergonomic and it's got a little gay boy grip and feels like you're holding someone else's penis and um, you know it's all good. Oh, it's potted. The handle's potted. That's quite good. The handle's got potting in there to make it, I don't know, maybe heavier and a bit more stiff. Um, but it's basically got a thumb screw there that you undo and then just release the whole thing. Big fucking wing nut on the end. Lovely, nice squared off thread. Um, you know, yeah, you don't need all this oh, click tickling. Fucking, you know, like I say, holding someone else's cock. Um, handle, ergonomic fucking bollocks. This is a fucking man's hacksaw. You mould your hands to the tool and fucking get on with the job. Honestly, whoever's going to win this, you're going to have to tell me about this just to fucking convince Corey. This thing, it's just fucking... It just feels like you... Like I say, in there, they pop the handle. So that's like slastic rubbery shit. They pop this entire handle... So it, it's not going to, it feels stiff and like someone else's dick. And also like a fucking genius. Um, he added some blades as well. So there's 10 blades in there. 
uh, what are these? Uh, 24 TPI. So it's 20 in there at the moment, I think. What it says? Yeah. But uh, these blades, honestly, if you have a hacksaw and you don't want to go out and buy a new one, you don't want to go and buy one of these because you're a wimp, that's fine. You know what I mean? You know, don't waste the hacksaw you got. Go and buy these fucking Eclipse blades. Buy metal. A lot of them are buy metal, I'll just say they are. <laughs> I had to go with a Draper one recently. Fuck me. Buy metal. Fucking homosexual metal. It fucking. Oh, no, hard work. And it flaked out. Um, Eclipse blades, the fucking nuts. I mean the nuts. Best blades I've ever used. Um, so that's that. Thank you, Corey, for that one. And uh, the other thing I got, which is rather small, but is just as important, and I love these. Now, I do have a set of these somewhere. Not this brand, though. But this is um, a set of timing spanners. Now, you probably don't know what timing spanners are, some of you. Timing spanners are, well, for timing, for points and all the rest of it, um, back in the day. Basically small little fucking sizes. So this goes from uh, 9 all the way down to uh, 3.2, 3 3.5, 4, 5, 5.5, 6, 6.5, 7, 8 and 9. But these are Japanese. And if you look, they've got this little card thing that shows you the sizes when you overlay it. Gorgeous little fucking set. Um, from Japan, like I said, there's a lot of Japanese print on there. You can see. Um, what's it say? Top grade heat treated, uh, hand, hardened and special steel made, tough quality die cast and precision machining finish. Set of a five electronics uh, work, mini open end spanners made in Japan. Fucking awesome. Um, but yeah, these, like I say, these are for the little nuts on the back of what is it, but we used to call these timing spanners, so there's them as well. And when you've got stuff like, uh, some of the tiny little fucking nuts as well on carbs and all the rest of it, they're just good to have, but you know, that's the, probably the little best little set you can get of the little tiny little spanners and what have you, because sometimes you can't get in there with a the socket, the little small sockets. Ah, whatever. Ah, and there is another one, but we're going to do, it's right in front of me. I'm going to do a separate video on that because it is sweet. It's so sweet, I don't have one. <laughs> uh, that's the one of the last ones. Like I say, I'll do a video in a minute about this sweet other tool that's going to the box. It deserves its entire own fucking, what is it? Uh, this week and next week I will be getting on to the people who asked if they wanted um, clarification if they have sent something through. People will keep on looking at the one where I did the naming and shaming. That was fucking a month and a half ago. Of course, if you put an application in, or you know, if you put a, a submission in, then of course it's not on that fucking video, is it, you muppets? Look at the dates. <laughs> hope that makes sense. Hope I make sense, and I'll see you in a bit.